how to create Anki flashcards with ChatGPT. So I have my notes opened right here. And of course, make sure you download Anki. You cannot do it on the web version. Okay, you have to download it. So I have the app installed right here. And what you want to do first, guys, is take your notes and you will copy this. And I want you to use this prompt, okay? Copy this prompt I'm going to give you. So I'm just telling uh, ChatGPT first, I'm going to tell it a context. It's very important you make ChatGPT understand what's going on. So I'm saying that I'm a medical student using Anki, which is a flashcard app that lets you import flashcards from a CSV file. So I have basically you can go ahead and read this prompt further if you want. But this is a prompt and I have told it that I'll attach the notes below. So I'm going to add a colon right here. After saying the notes are and then add a colon so it knows where the notes actually start. So I'm going to get and copy everything from let's see chapter one. Okay, let me copy all these notes really quick. Let's get these notes from page one. We'll get we'll get to chapter one. You're gonna give it one part at a time. If you give it too many at once, it'll not even work because there's also a character limit you wanna be aware of, right? And then let's see. Let's give this prompt to ChatGPT, and it should give us a CSV file. Because the important thing is, guys, you know, Anki, you can only import. As CSV files directly. So let's wait for ChatGPT to be done with this prompt. As you can see, this is what it's currently doing. So if you want, you can go ahead and see what's going to happen, but we're just going to wait for it to be done. All right, it is done with the back end work, and then it asks us, Would you like me to save and upload the CSV file for you? Go ahead and say, Yes, kindly give me the CSV file. Okay, and then just go ahead and press enter and let ChatGPT generate a CSV file for you for this. And if not, you know, you can just go ahead and manually copy this and create your own CSV file. It's really easy and simple. So just, just wait for ChatGPT for now. All right, here we go. The CSV file has been created. Just go ahead and click on it, download the flashcard, and it will automatically start downloading the file. So here we go. This is the file right here. You know, you can open it right as well to go ahead and check it out. But just go to Anki. Come click on file. Now what you're gonna do guys right here is you're gonna go ahead and click on import. Okay, and now it will run the file. Okay, here we go. This is our flashcards. Go ahead and open this up. We're importing this file. So we have question and answer. And now you can go through this if you want, but this is what it will look like. And you can choose the, uh, you know, field separator. You wanna choose the correct options you want to match the fields right right so that's what you want to do so i need you to make some changes right this is not what it's supposed to look like so the field separator you want to change this to comma see looks much better now scroll down here it says we have field mapping we have front and back so one is question two is answer okay that's fine so I'm going to go ahead and import this. And now we are getting it imported to Anki. As you can see, this is what it looks like. We have easily imported a lot of flashcards into Anki. And it's really that easy and simple, guys. You can see front, back. So this will be the question. And when you, you know, flip the card, right, it will show the answer. Really easy and simple, guys. So I hope this video helped you out.